today, the entries have seemed, for lack of a better word, classy. <laughs> I take it you're about to correct that problem. Yes. <laughs> yes. You know how sometimes you have an idea that's so good, it starts good, and as it goes, it just gets better and better and snowballs into a, a balloon of awesomeness? This is one of those ideas that started out bad, and it just kept getting worse and worse. <laughs> and worse. <laughs> this, this is the, the, the original poem is an instant in the life of James V of Scotland. <laughs> Um, it's in the form of a prose dialogue, and is entitled simply, The Fifth of Scotland. Oh. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's, oh be it, believe me, if, if that was where we stopped, you know, <laughs> <laughs> that's the beginning. The Fifth of Scotland was attacked manfully. Poor man by came so high that he flailed. And the king, saying, no harm, fetch towel and water, wash off his hands. My John, I need not dread it. Perhaps you'll be a present to gratify me. It shall not be denied. Huh, no harm. I like to farm. You give my mind relief. Goodman, meet me Sunday. I'll repay. Don't you sport. I pledge you shall see. So John put on his clothes and appeared, as you may suppose, freed from grief. His friend the king took by the apartment kindly, then asked if he'd like to see. Oh yes, I would really. How am I? Be uncovered. Then John was filled. Then said John, I hope I will very soon. Then the king said, I give you a towel in my hands if ever I come. Then John said, thanks your majesty, I'll willingly obey. <laughs> 